All right, what is going on guys? Coach Joe here at the Lion's Den. And in this video, I wanna talk about my favorite barbell, okay? It's probably my most used barbell by me personally in the gym. And a lot of the members in here have really loved it because it's, it's a little bit newer here. Uh, but man, let's show them. Let's show them what we got. Boom, baby. This is the American Cambered Bar from Elite FTS. And there are a couple big reasons why I love this bar so much. And let's just start off with the basics that you can see right away. I mean, we got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight handles, which is basically four different grip options for one side, right? Because we have the camber side, right? Where I guess they're both camber side, but we have, let's just call it the up and the down, all right? so. There are just so many different grip options on here, which I just absolutely love. So that's like the first thing that I love about it. The other thing is just how versatile it can be, right? We can use it not only for bench pressing, but we can use it for overhead pressing. We can even row with this bar. So I'd probably piggyback that as like the first one is all the grip options and just the overall versatility uh, of using this bar. Now, the second thing that I absolutely love about uh, using this bar is when it comes to versatility, right? I can use this to basically mimic uh, a pin or a board press, right? When this is touching my chest. And then if I want more range of motion, okay? Or maybe I'm doing a variation or I'm doing more hypertrophy or I'm looking for a deeper stretch, I can flip it over and now we're getting a couple inches uh, deeper than normal with a normal barbell. And I'll, I'll tell you, you can absolutely feel this thing smoke in your chest more with that extra range of motion. So that's like my second favorite part about this. So if I'm doing strength, typically I like to do like a board press or maybe I'm gonna be working a wider grip, right? So we'll do like a wide board press variation with this bar and I don't have to get a board right, I don't have to change the barbell, it's all right here. And then when I'm doing my hypertrophy, right, I can flip it over and I can either smoke my triceps out of the closer grip, or if I wanna keep it wide, I'm trying to focus on just getting my chest bigger, right, we can do that as well, getting an increased range of motion. So absolutely just phenomenal bar for that reason. Now, the last reason why I love this barbell so much is when you're doing strength training, guys, I don't know if you know this, but you probably do by now, you get aches and pains, you get tweaks, things happen, all right? When you're training heavy and you're training hard, uh, it's just par for the course, okay? And I'll say this, or dare I say this, when you wanna be really good at something, you often fall into the extreme category of things. And we probably agree that extreme, or extremism in general isn't necessarily a good thing, okay? So we're training hard, we're getting after it, right? We're pushing those fatigue levels, aches and pains happen. And when they do, my number one go-to is changing up variations to cater around the injury or whatever I'm feeling. So if I'm having some sort of shoulder pain or a tweak anywhere in my upper body, maybe I can utilize different variations with this bar to help me keep training, right? So if you guys have shoulder problems, if you've tweaked something in your upper body um, and you still wanna train around that tweak, this bar has been phenomenal for doing that, all right? Um, and the other thing that I, I'll kind of add just that I forgot to is I do love an angled grip. So if you guys have used a multi-grip bar uh, or a Swiss bar with straight grips, great bar, love it, have them here too. Um, but then if you've also used an angled multi-grip bar, I find that it's a lot better and easier uh, on the shoulders. Now we have the camber, it's like, okay, come on, come on. Like, this thing's amazing. So this is definitely not a sales pitch for this bar, even though it sounds like it is. And if you buy it, you're gonna be happy because I'm excited about it or else I wouldn't make this video. And I think if you have uh, the money to do it, I think it was like maybe 300 or less dollars. Can't remember off the top of my head, but it was kind of a no brainer for me as a gym owner. Uh, and if you guys have a garage gym or your own gym, I know you're gonna love this bar. I know the members in your gym are gonna love this bar. So absolutely. Uh, a necessity if you guys have the capital uh, or if you have some tweaks, some shoulder issues, or you just want some good variation. Elite FTS, American Camber Bar, buy it or be a loser. 
that's it. That's all we got. So uh, make sure you guys like the video, subscribe to the channel, stay in Lean Mean Train Machine. Catch you guys next time. Peace.